Hey, this is Gospel Musicians Jamal Hartwell coming at you, as I always say. Hey, look, I got a special treat for you guys. As you can see, I'm holding my little bit of equipment here. And I wanna show you a little something that a lot of you guys do not realize, okay? This is a Yamaha Motif ES keyboard. And this is a Yamaha Motif ES keyboard upside down. All right, so let's come on in here and let me show you something, all right? Now I took all the screws out. You're gonna wanna have one of these babies cause doing your hand like that with all them screws is gonna take a lot of time. So what we have here, we we'll open up the back of this little black thing here, move this out the way. And what we have here in my hand is a Yamaha, uh, well is a, is, a, is, a, is a memory slot. This is a 512 meg memory slot. And it amazes me to no end how many people do not realize that you can put memory in your new motif or old motif or whatever. You can put memory in it and actually be able to load sounds. Yeah, uh, when I took a random poll of uh, a lot of people on my website, a lot of people did not realize that you can you can actually take the same kind of computer memory and install it into your keyboard and give you different sounds. Okay, now. The beauty of this is, once I install this memory, that gives me RAM, okay? And I'm not gonna start using terms like volatile and non-volatile RAM, I'm just gonna simply say, the thing with this RAM is not flash RAM, so when you turn the keyboard off, you lose your sounds. But the benefit is, if you're bored of the same sounds, if you're losing inspiration on your keyboard that you have, you can pop in some of this RAM, and you can get a whole new inspiration by installing new sounds, third party sounds, and sounds that we are now actually creating. Yes, we are in the business of creating sounds now. So, now let me show you how to install this, okay? And let's zoom in here. Might wanna turn that light on so we can make sure. Now, this is the back of the Yamaha Motif ES keyboard. Here, right here, is the uh, MLAN card, okay? You might not have that, so yours will look different than mine. I have the MLAN installed. Now, these are two uh, 512 SD RAM PC 133, 133 megahertz um, that we actually sell on our own website. So you can go to uh, store.gospelmusicians.com and I think it's motif RAM and we actually sell the RAM. We sell it for a good price, to, to be honest. It's kind of cheaper than most. So, the thing about this RAM, here's the slots right here, okay? Here are the slots right here. Now what you wanna do, now say I go in here and I take this slot and I go here. Now I'm just letting you know right now this is the wrong way. And when I install it, try and push it down, it won't push down, okay? Because there's only one specific way that you can install it, all right? So what you wanna do is go to the edge here, just put it here, this is how I like to do it. Line it up here. Actually, what you wanna do is you wanna put the furthest one in first, back there, because it's gonna be hard to get your hands through there, so you wanna use the, the slot that's uh, closest to the left side, I guess, if you wanna call it that. So I put the slot in there, and I slide it in there, and I simply make sure it snaps. You gotta make sure it snaps, all right? Once it snaps, you know it's in there. Now I'm kind of breaking a rule a little bit because I should have an anti-static uh, wristband um, uh, to ground the static. So what I do before I install everything, I just make sure I pop all the static on myself so that uh, I don't have any static because one little zap of static will knock your memory out. So uh, here we go again. Just put it on the side and make sure we're up here. Go right down there, push it snap didn't snap as loud but as long as you feel a snap pushing it down I always double push it to make sure it's in and now I have two 512 meg which is one gig of RAM that I can start loading my own samples in so now you can see it's in there it's flush it's snapped in we are ready to go all right so this got some musicians showing you how to install the new RAM that we have and now we're gonna go further and I'm gonna show you the new samples that we have that are very awesome. Uh, a lot of these samples were secret. A lot of people was asking me, 
what sounds I use. I didn't tell them because it was my secret sounds and now I'm giving my secret sounds to you. So, your Yamaha Motif keyboard, if you have an ES, XS, and even, not even the new XF, but if you have the old classic, the ES, and the XF, XS, as in Sam, you can install user installable RAM to put more sounds and more samples that are totally different from the waveform rounds in your waveform ROM that's in your keyboard to give you an entirely new inspiration, entirely new sounds, and entirely almost an entirely new keyboard by installing the RAM. You can install new sounds. So we're gonna get to the point where we're installing these sounds and we're gonna let you. Uh, here are these new sounds that we have, these new sound li libraries that we have coming up. All right, checking out Gospel Musicians.